Hi, this is Steve from the G Suite Tips team here in the UK. And you can find us online as usual at gsuitetips.com, our website with all the tips. And you can follow us on Twitter and on Google Plus and the YouTube channel. So today's tip is to show you the new functionality in Google Drive to allow you to search within a folder. And I'm hopefully going to demo that nice and quickly for you. So here I am in Google Drive. And I'm in my drive. And I know that in my drive, there are a number of files with the name logo, or including the word logo. So I'm just going to type logo into here and hit return. And I'll do a search. And you can see that I'm now searching across all of my drive. That's everything that's in my drive, whether it's owned by me or owned by somebody else or shared into me, but it's in my drive. Um, this has brought back a whole bunch of uh, results here. Okay. And it might be that I could find the thing that I'm after. Okay. So that's a conventional search. I could, of course, have used the drop down here and said type uh, photos and images. And then that should just bring back photos before there were some PDF files there. So if I take away the type image and just look again for logo, you can see some PDF files come up. And that's searching a drive that you're probably used to doing. So what we can do is um, if I look in my drive here, you can see I've got this projects folder. And one of the projects is called Project X. And within Project X, if I click through to there, we've got design, plans, reports. If I click into design and then assets, you can see that we've got some, some um, images here, JPEG, PNGs, and things. And one of them actually has the logo word in there. Uh, as part of the file name. So if I now were in looking only in Project X, okay, I can click on this drop down and say search within Project X, or I could be up one and look at Project X and right click on it and say search within Project X. And then I'm now seeing it searching in Project X. And if I type the word logo, hit return. You can now see that it's only brought up that one image because we've restricted the search to Project X. I'm just going to close that off again. You can also do this if I go back to My Drive. On the drop down here, if I click on Location Anywhere, it now shows you the ability to go and search somewhere. So I'm going to look inside My Drive. I'm going to go to Projects. This time I'll just say Projects and select. And I'm going to put an um, item name logo again and this time you'll see i've got the one i was after project x logo and also the general one which is in a different folder so if i change this to look not in projects but to look in my drive in projects and then project x select and then search this time it's only looking inside there and it finds the one file that i'm after so it's quite an easy thing to uh, to manipulate and to use, but a pretty powerful option there to aid searching and restricting searching. It's important you realize that this stuff has to exist in your, in your drive or if you have access to them in your team drive. If it's in shared with me, it won't show up unless you've um, in some way added it to your drive. So that's the tip for today. Reminder, you can click. Uh, into the search and select a folder from the My Drive in that way. Or when you're navigating, you can right-click on a folder and search within it from there. And you'll see searching in. And that's it. So um, I hope that makes sense. Have some fun playing with that. Let us know how you get on in the comments. And a uh, reminder, gsuitetips.com for your tips. And you can find us on the Twitter and Google Plus and YouTube. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one.